Hey everyone, I'm Andrew and welcome to Tech Check. In today's video, I'll be unboxing the Be Quiet Pure Wings 2 PWM fan, which is in their Be Quiet Essential series and comes in sizes from 80 to 140 millimeters. So before we get into it, just going to look over the box, starting with the front, where you obviously have a picture of the fan, you got the brand and the model, up here letting you know that it's a 1500 RPM model with PWM and it's from their Essential Collection. Now, this does come in a high-speed model, which I believe is 2,000 RPMs. However, it's going to increase your noise level slightly, so that's something to think about. Quickly looking at the back. Of course, at the top right, you have the Be Quiet branding. On the left here, just some bullet points, letting you know that it's a perfect choice for home and office PCs, as well as gaming and multimedia systems. You get nine airflow-optimized fan blades to ensure the best balance between cooling and silence as well as your high quality rifle bearing technology contributes to a very long lifespan of up to 80,000 hours. Basically same thing in Dutch and French right there and over here just your specifications on how the fan runs at 100% voltage. You got your fan speed, your noise level, airflow and pressure, pressure for if you were putting it on a rad or something, then your input power and current as well as the connector lifespan and letting you know that it does come with four screws for installation purposes. All right, now that we've gone over the box, I've gotten rid of the other two fans because it's all basically going to be the same unboxing. So to open up this box, basically just got to pull this top flap here. Should reveal the actual fan. Yep, there it is right there. As you can see the cable and the connector. It's not braided or anything, but this is in their budget series or their price to performance series. And of course, you have your four included screws, which I'll always wonder why they give you silver screws with a black fan. If anybody out there works for like a fan company or something, just could you let me know in the comments how much more expensive it is to add black screws instead of silver screws? I don't know. Enough of that. Let's get back to the fan. As you can see, you got the fan right there with the cable going across it. I'm just going to try and slide it out here. Move that packaging to the side. And there you have your fan right there. As you can notice, as I said, it's kind of in the price to performance class, the essential class, so you're not getting any frills like rubber grommets or even a braided cable or anything like that, but this still is said to be one of the quietest fans they do have. You have the nine airflow optimized blades. You can see all the grooves, which I'm guessing makes them airflow optimized. Then you have right here, the back of the fan, letting you know that it is the Be Quiet Pure Wings 2. And it's got the model number right there, as well as DC 12 volt and 0.2 amps, as well as 1500 RPMs. Now this 0.2 amps is actually important because a lot of people like to run something like this here, like a fan splitter. However, you don't want to overload your motherboard fan header, so you got to be sure you know. Normally they're about 1 amp, so one fan header should be able to control about 4 to 5 of these no problem. Some fan headers are going to be different, but that's what you want to pay attention to. Then, of course, you got the quality control stuff and made in China and another, probably the making date or something like that. But that's about it. The fan itself, it's got a little bit of flex, but that's okay. You don't want it to be pure solid, right? It is going to be rotating. You want just a little bit of flex, especially when you install it. But not too much, so that's good. Feels like a quality product. Uh, I've used Be Quiet fans before, and I'm, I'm really actually, I've been quite happy with them. Um, and the main reason why I picked these up is because Mike's Computer Shop actually had them on sale for $7.99 Canadian, hence why I ran in and grabbed three, right? But I guess that's going to be about it for my unboxing. Just cutting back in here quickly, some people have asked me, how do they know which way the airflow goes through these fans? Well, on most fans, I'm not going to say all of them because some of those cheap ones don't have it. They have these little arrows right here letting you know that the air pushes through that way and up that way. So if you want to install this and like push air down, you'd push it this way and the air would come out like this. If you were to flip it, the air would come up like this. So yeah, that's just one more thing that they include on these fans. Most fan manufacturers do, but some people don't know about it. So there's something neat. I didn't know about it at first and... When I did, I've always looked for it since. So I've had some people comment before about me not testing the fans. Unfortunately, 
I don't have the proper tools to test these fans and I'm just getting my portable test bench together now that might help me with that situation, show more of testing, but I've ins actually installed these three fans into my Lian Li O11 Dynamic to show you what they look like installed. I have them uh, across the top, three 120 millimeters, so that's 360 millimeters of Be Quiet Pure Wings 2 fans exhausting all the hot air from my system, which actually doesn't feel that warm right now, however it is just idling. Um, these fans here are actually replacing the Arctic Bionics F140s that I did have in here. I just found, since I got the new desk and computer sitting a bit closer to me, it was a bit too loud. And these have solved that issue. So, I really like them. And at the sale price of $7.99 Canadian that I picked them up from Mike's Computer Shop, I think I actually should have got a couple more. Well, thanks for watching my unboxing of the Be Quiet Pure Wings 2 PWM fan. If you're interested in learning more about this fan or any of Be Quiet's lineup, I'll have some links posted in the description below where you can do just that. And if you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up, leave a comment, and possibly subscribe. I'm Andrew, and this was Tech Check.